A substitute teacher arrested when a young girl accused him of molesting her. The Kent School District removed the teacher from its substitute list when it learned of those allegations. As Cover 7's Deborah Horn reports now, the child's parents handled the accusation in a nearly textbook fashion. According to these court documents, the parents of this six-year-old girl began by asking her to tell them about her day here at Emerald Park School. She told them the substitute teacher had her sit on his lap. Soon, she was telling them an even more troubling story. According to court documents, the sexual assault happened while the kindergarten class at Emerald Park Elementary was at recess. The six-year-old stayed behind, and the teacher, 72-year-old John DiVitio, allegedly placed her on his lap to watch a video. She said he hugged her throughout and touched her inappropriately. To just hear that, that, that anything like that would happen um, and, and how it happened. When we met parent Craig Inlow, he showed us an email the school principal sent out early last week alerting parents to the investigation. It's a scary thing if, if your kids don't know the, the right touching and well, what's right and what's wrong. So. And you've done that with your children? Oh, yes. Very, very much so. According to records we obtained from the superintendent of public instruction, Diva Teo was issued an emergency substitute certificate at the end of January 2018 to teach in the Kent School District. Staffers told investigators he has substituted for several teachers at multiple Kent schools. In his application, Diva Teo answered no to all questions regarding a criminal history. If I was that girl's parents, I would... I would demand that the entire Kent School District gets a camera in each classroom. They have the cameras outside. I don't know why they don't have them in the classrooms. This parent agrees. School, especially in the classrooms when you have young children involved. And I do take that seriously because I have kids that go into school. In a statement, the Kent School District said as soon as the allegations came to light, the teacher was removed as a substitute. Now, Kent police tell us they have completed their investigation here at Emerald Park. But they tell us anyone who has information that might help in that investigation should still call 911. As for that teacher, he remains free on bail pending his arraignment next week. Reporting in Kent, Deborah Horn, Cairo 7 News. New